What is cracking, guys? And uh, it is your boy, Dom B, aka Bethos Kicks. Sorry for the wait. Sorry for the wait. Um, sorry, guys, I haven't really updated videos. I've actually been recording, I just don't have time to upload. Uh, for those of you who know that follow me on IG, I already know that I uh, currently um, got another job or switch job, so I'm working a little bit closer to home, so no more of those long commutes. So I'm going to kind of sum up stuff that I've been kind of picking up. Um, again, for those that got follow me on IG at Bethel's Kiss with a Z, I already know the stuff I've been picking up. So these are kind of some of the projects I've been working on, restorations. I picked these up for a ridiculous amount. I can't even say because some of you guys are going to be like, no way. But yeah, pretty much next to nothing. Um, I think I had pictures up on my IG on these. Um, I think it was this one right here. It was this pair right here. So this guy had tried to re-glue the whole saw because there's actually still separation in it. And he spilled nothing but glue all over that midsole right there. And I actually took it out. Um, you guys should definitely check out the pictures. You won't believe. It took me a while to get it off there. But yeah, I finally got it off because it was literally black. I mean, you could still see a little bit of uh, darkness, everybody. Darkness. But yeah, <laughs> it was just horrible, man. I cleaned it up. Um, did the whole tongue. A little bit on the inside. Um, a little bit on the outside, the peanut butter exterior. Um, I just got to re glue it as you can see. I cleaned that the toe box, I reshaped it, ironed it out because it was just horrible. But yeah, that's kind of a little bit of updates, guys. And now, is there, is there anything you guys like to see or any type of restoration? If you guys have questions, you could definitely comment below and let me know or stuff that you might want to see. I also picked up these, uh, uh, white flip threes for a steel that's all I could say um, the top was a little bit dirty so was a tongue um, things I got to do on this is of course I got to hit that uh, jump man with a silver again as you can see that it's kind of peeling off there is some minor parts missing to this jump man the sneakers are missing <laughs> but I mean I can I can kind of fix that a little bit um, no cracks on the midsole. Light touch-ups, a little bit of yellowness to the back tab there. <clears throat> Interior is flawless. You can kind of still see the jump in there. Can you guys see that there? Yeah. Leather interior. As you can see that there, little light touch-ups. And this is actually the only paint that's uh, falling off right now, appealing. So, light touch-ups I got to do on this one. Um very mad about oh hold up first off make sure you guys go check out dope tags.com boy daily down i did cop i did make the video but i just didn't have time to upload it so i will throw it in this make sure you check them out for dope tags and you can make some custom tags too so on these as i was saying these mars mars 3 i bought these vnds no creases no nothing on these Real mad, man. The first day I wore these, yeah, you guessed it. Mad cracks in the paint. Toe box got all, yeah. There were literally no scuffing to these, and yeah, man. I could take that. That's nothing, but this is what makes me mad. Hairline cracks. Hey, what else do you want more from a 2006 sneaker? So, yeah what it is i'll fix these up but yeah man i was i was real mad man when i took them off and i came after work to see all that i was real disappointed but yeah i'm gonna touch these up and then we'll make a video for you guys i will show you how to touch that up and i might take out those creases on the toe box i'll let you guys know let me speed this up i'm probably taking too long uh, i picked up these pistons for a ridiculous price Trying to get a better lining for you guys. We come right over here. If you guys know, I was trying to uh, unyellow that bottom. It don't look too bad now, but before it was it was pretty bad. I'm trying to focus the damn camera. There it is. A little bit of heel drag there. 
But besides that, everything else is pretty good. Nice shape, no ungluing, no cracks. Um, this I will fix that. I will actually probably do a video. Um, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be dyeing this black. Should be super easy. Nothing nothing major. Um, so yeah, the bottom. I was actually trying to ice them up. Um, the sides got a little bit icy, but the rest is just it's piss yellow. I hate piss yellow. And of course, for those that do know, I still have these, which I'm currently still looking for donors. If you guys got anything, Son of Mars, or any other white cement three bottoms, let me know. I mean, this will still the midsole's okay, but it's about a it's about to give out, man. When you start pushing on it and you start to feel it go in pretty deep and starts to crumble, those are all signs that your midsole is about to go out. And also the bottom sole is pretty worn out too. So that's my project, man. I will be showing you guys a video of how to unyellow the netting here. So that's about it, man. Like, comment, subscribe, man. If you guys have any questions or any other type of restorations or tips that you might need, definitely hit me up and also check me out at Bet Those Kicks on IG. That's about it. You guys stay up, stay fresh, stay fitted, rock what you like. I forgot a hype. Peace, fellas. Like.